be the mercies of the power that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice. Yeah, man, sacrifice. You know. So yeah, you gotta consistently present your body a sacrifice. You know. This is a sac this is this is presenting our body a sacrifice, man. You know, we could be doing all kind of dumb evil shit, man. But we chose to, to set aside time. To set aside time for the Lord, man. And do this work, man. Hey, this is the first thing I think about, man. Especially on camp day, man. This is the first thing I think about, man. Today is camp. You know? And my whole day revolves around camp, man. Time doesn't revolve around my black ass, man. I could die tonight, man. My whole day, my whole structure and day revolves around what time I gotta be ready for camp, man. And if there's any hindrance in between that, man, I, I'm mad as a motherfucker, bro. I'm upset, man. I hate being, I hate being late to do the Lord's work. Man. And you know, the Lord has time for you. But the Lord understands, like, when you have situations beyond your control, the Lord has mercy, man. But if you're just a sluggard nigga, that don't want to do it, man. That fuck you, man. The Lord gonna you out, man. That's what I hear. You know how the, the guys don't believe in the uh, Old Testament. Basically, they don't believe in the Old Testament, man. But basically, it requires you to do You don't, you don't, you don't feel have to do that, man. You just have to sit, basically sit and wait. And that's a sign from spirit. I got a... Uh, Acceptable unto the power, which is your reasonable service. I got some kind of, this is uh, Hebrews 10 and 22. It says, Let us draw near with the true heart and full assurance of faith, having our hearts sprinkled from an evil conscience of our bodies washed with pure water. Let us hold fast the profession of our faith without wavering. For he is faithful that promised. Proverbs. This is Proverbs 12, 24. He said, the hand of the hand of the diligent shall, shall bear rule, but the slothful shall shall be under tribute. But you under tribute, man. That fucking Judas purse you took, man. You got to you, you got to spear, you got to spear off that bullshit to keep getting fucking paid. You know, if you don't, nigga, your, your payday is over with, man. So you got to keep about that shit, man. So that that slop for ass spirit is going to have its just rule, man. And Lord is going to recompense that shit right back to your ass, man. Just like just like Judas, at the end, he was sorry. The motherfucker went and burst his motherfucking guts out, man. And the Lord is going to do that to you. Yeah. What are those niggas Judas, man? Yohanna, Nate, one of them guys, man. Oh, Comfy, one of them guys are Judas, man. Nate, Nate, there's, uh, Nate, there's, there's Caiaphas. Caiaphas, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the high priest. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah. Kai, might Kai. be that nigga, man. Kai, bro. Real, Kai. man. Reincarnated, man. I got a scripture, uh, too, about, uh, backing you about niggas that love here in America like Nate now. This is, uh, Jeremiah 42 is, I'm going to start at 12. It says, and I will show, and I will show mercies unto you, that he may have mercy upon you, and cause you to return to your own land. You know, these niggas don't want to go to Israel, yeah, man. They, they have to be here, man. Right. Like, scoop, like, hey, some the brother script, the brother just put out, Mike, this is not your rest. Right. But if you say, we will not dwell in this land, Neither obey the voice of the Lord your God. Right, man, because y'all ain't looking to dwell in our land, dwell in our kingdom, man. And you're not obeying the voice of the Lord God, man. Right. And, and, through, through who? GMS, man. The ones you hate so damn much, man. That's right. The, one that's put, the ones that's pushing the truth, man. Saying no, but we will go into the land of Egypt. Yeah, oh, we, we happy here in America, man. Huh. Uh, Right. Well, we shall see no war. He, he, he's fucking on. Um, um, ha happy days, Israelites, man. Burgers and fringes, man. Nor hear the sound of the trumpet, 
You're gonna have hunger and bread. That, that's them, man. That, that's why they call us bums, man. Right. And then we read, read that part over again. God, it says, uh, no, but we was going to the land of Egypt. Right, which is what? Here, right here in America, man. We're looking to go into the land of Egypt. Read. Uh, well, we shall see no more. Right. No, I hear the sound they, of the trumpet. That's why they don't teach about the prophecies, man. Because right. war is coming to America. So basically, you got your, your, your congregation got out of hell, man. They ain't teaching about the martial law. The sound of the trumpet, man. Read. No, I have hunger and bread. Uh huh. You ain't teaching about the famine either. Read. And their world, their will we dwell. Yeah, you got these niggas thinking that we're going to be here in America and we're going to be A OK, -okay, man. So you looking to dwell here in America, man. Read. And now, therefore, hear the word of the Lord. He remnant of Judah. Uh huh. Thus said the Lord of Judah. Judah. Who tried you from? Judah. Everybody from Judah in there, man. Right. <laughs> hey, even they changed his uh. How you know all you motherfuckers ain't no damn Gadites, man? Everybody ain't fucking Judah, man. Well, hell, yeah, Nate is the first person I ever seen change their nationality while they still alive. Because remember, he was teaching the name, he's supposed yeah, to be gay. He's supposed to be gay. Now all of a sudden, he's Judah. Now he's Judah. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. God. God. It says, and now therefore, hear the word of the Lord, ye remnant of Judah, mm -hmm. thus said the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, if ye wholly set your faces to enter into Egypt and go to sojourn there, then it shall come to pass that the sword which he feared shall overtake you there. Right, right. Eventually, the, the things that y'all not teaching about, the sword is going to overtake you, man. And the Lord is going to have his so-called cracker roll down on you, man. And put, put you niggas in the, one day, hey, 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 one day, y'all going to be in, in one of them lessons, man. And Esau going to run up in that school and just start apprehending niggas, man. Y'all going to be calling off to those concentration camps. Said, well, if you were afraid, you should follow close to death and death and there you should have died. No, and there you should die. And that's why you niggas don't teach about the prophecies. Because really, you're afraid, man. That's what it is, man. You niggas are afraid, man. They have no faith. You don't, you don't got no faith, man. Hey, who got the Hebrews? Going at the top one? Yeah, top one. Con. Hebrews chapter four. Let us therefore fear, least a promise being left. Oh man, that's a good one. Let us that Nate, Nate and them got the fear of the Lord, man. That's why they teach that bullshit. You don't gotta know the name. The mark of the beast is not the chip. Read. Least a promise being left us of entering into his rest. Any of you should oh, see. God. Let us therefore fear, least a promise being left us of entering into his rest. Right, enter into our rest, man. But this ain't our rest. You're looking to you get beamed up on the chariots, man. Enter into Jerusalem, read. Enter into that, that new covenant, read. Any of you should seem to come short of. Right, which is y'all. Y'all coming short, man. Because I'm most definitely short, man. If you're not teaching the name, you, you're coming short, man. The engine to your rest, man. Three. For unto us was the gospel preached as well unto them. Mm -hmm. But the word preached did not profit them, mm -hmm. not being mixed with faith in them that heard it. For we which have believed to do slacking. For we which have believed 
do enter into rest. Yeah, we. Oh man. So you guys don't really believe, man. So you ain't gonna enter into the rest, man. You guys have any fear or any any faith, man? All right, man. You you will. Hey, man. You'll be teaching the name, man. It's, it's, it's all, man, you can't barely go through the scriptures without hearing the name, the name, the name, the name, the name, the name, the name. name. Y'all get mad at us when, when we when we give all praises to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Oh, oh, them guys can't say a sentence without saying that name. You mock it, man. Free. As I have sworn in my wrath, if they shall enter into my rest, although the works were finished from the foundation. Yeah, yeah, you enter into, so it's already set up who's going to uh, uh, enter into the rest, man. He, he said what? My works was, was finished from the foundation, man. What we do, we just playing on the part of the Lord's movie, man. And two-thirds of our people, the so-called white men of other nations, and these false-ass Israelites are the fucking bad guy. GMS are the good guys. All right. Although the works were finished from the foundation of the world, for he spake in a certain place of the seventh day on this wise, and the power did rest the seventh day. Yeah, man. Even the Lord himself rests, man. After making the heavens and the earth, man. And, and we, we rested too, man, because we was part of the, like he told Peter, you was with me from the beginning. We, we was help making the heavens and the earth. Right, the, the, the water and all that, man. So we rested on the seven day too. Read. And the power did rest. You niggas say don't even believe in reincarnation, man. Go ahead. And the power did rest the seventh day from all his works. And in this place again, if they shall enter into my rest, Go ahead. seeing therefore it remaineth that some must enter therein, and they to whom it, it was first preached, enter not in because of unbelief. Yeah, man, because you had uh, uh, certain people that didn't that that basically when we came out of Egypt, man, the Lord just killed them off, man. They was talking shit against Moses, man. You know? Then eventually what the Lord did to Israel when we came out the out the wilderness, he circled he had them go in the desert and circle basically go in a circle for like 40 years, man. To to the to the to the reprobates died, man. Yeah. Then he had Joshua and them enter to the kingdom, man. Yeah. You know, it's, it's funny, every time we enter into some type of kingdom, a lot of people got to die. Yeah, man. According to the scriptures, because you know, when we... <laughs> Casualties of war, man. Yeah, a lot of people die, man. Hey, from the time we were up until now, man. Yeah. <laughs> every time we enter into some type of, you know, rulership, man, people are getting... Get, the fact gets, you know? gets skimmed away, man. Again, he limited a certain day, saying to in David, today, after so long a time, as it as it is said, today, if ye will hear his voice, heart not your hearts. They harden in their hearts, man. All right. What was that? It acts you you like it, you know it acts you because uh, you resist the Holy Ghost. You, you still resist the Holy Ghost, man? You can find the Holy man? Those those same niggas, man. You got that in the uh, Isaiah? Spoken of another day. Uh -huh. 
therefore, so I can there remain it, therefore, a rest to the people of God. For he that is entered into his rest, he also had ceased from his own works, as the power did from his. Let us labor, therefore, therefore, to enter into the rest. Right. Oh, 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 he said, let, therefore, let us labor to enter into our rest. So you ain't supposed to be taking off no damn winter, man. You supposed to be laboring, man. It's a constant labor, man. That's why the elder put out put out their order, man. Brothers, they ain't making videos as being slothful, man. Hey, they, they looking to they kick brothers out, man. Being slothful and shit, man. Basically, you, you trying to have your rest, man. Read. Did any man fall after the same example of unbelief? Ooh, man. That's what's going to happen, man. A lot of brothers going to fall off, man. Brothers going to fall off, man, that day, man. But not having belief. Basically, the word belief is basically faith, man. Not having faith, man. And they don't like the word faith. Faith-based Israelites. That's what he said. Well, you change it as belief-based. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks for the call. Yeah. What the fuck? Who knows? You, you niggas are just reprobates, man. Concerning the faith, man. You guys are reprobates on all levels, man. The only thing you niggas got right on the 12 trials board, man. And the little milk scriptures, man. Besides everything else, man, you niggas ain't deep at all, man. You're just a bunch of damn charlatans. Don't know the proper breakdown of the scriptures. Man, y'all simple as hell, man. Just, man, I'll be shitting them niggas up, man. Every time I run across, man, one of the IUIC niggas, man, I shut their ass down completely, man. To where they, they, they don't even answer back, man. You torment them in the spirit, man. And you know what? People know, know who we are by, by how we quote how we, uh, scripture. them that are wise in their own eyes and prudent in their own sight. Hey man, you can't tell them they ain't, they ain't them guys actually think that deep, man. The man being Haitian, I think they think they Because Christ is Jesus. You can't tell them they ain't, they ain't deep, man. But you think this is, this, this is whack, man. Woe unto them that are mighty to drink wine, and men of strength to mingle strong drink, which justify the wicked for reward and take yeah, away. You, you, you guys ain't nothing. What did he say? Mingle? You mingle what? Mingle strong drink. Yeah, so you niggas ain't nothing but some, some Christianity Israelites, man. You some Roman Catholic Israelites, man. That's right. That's all you niggas are, man. Roman Catholic Israelites. Niggas might as well put up Caesar Bogier. You all, you screaming Christ? You might as well, man. Hey, yeah, you guys got half truths, man. Which equals a lie, man. A half truth is a damn lie, man. Yeah. Either you got the hundred percent truth or not, man. Yeah, man. There's no gray area. Half truths, man. What the hell, man? You guys are playing, man. I mean, that's why the Lord gon' gon' go 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 send he gon' send the rope up there, man. He gon' start knocking you niggas off with them purple garments, man. Man, I, ooh, I, man, I hope, man, you, you niggas, a lot of you niggas die tonight, man. Cause you guys are playing with the word of the Lord, man. But that's all right, the Lord got some 
got something for y'all, man. We got you niggas set up, man. When y'all in them concentration camps, don't be trying to remember the name then, man. Praises now. Yeah, and, and really, I'm gonna say this, man. And really, you, you, y'all worship, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, uh, the Lord, man. You guys really worship Nate, man. That's your God, man. Nate is you niggas' God, man. Who the fuck is? Who the fuck is Christ? Who the fuck is that, man? Who the fuck is God, man? That, that's not their name. So if you're not worshiping them. Because the scriptures say, them that worship me should worship me in what? Spirit and in truth, man. So if you're not worship, who the fuck you worship? You niggas worship Nate, man. Yep. You gotta take it a step further than that, because Nate don't even believe in how about Shimmy was shot. Yep. He worships Satan. Yeah, he worships Satan, they worship Nate. Right. Hey, you got that nice There's an order to it. <laughs> there you go. Go ahead, yeah, yeah, man. It's Isaiah 3 and 6. Yeah. He said, when a man shall take hold of his brother at the house of his father, saying, Thou hast clothing, but thou but thou art ruler. No. When a, when a man shall take hold of his brother's house, and his father said, saying, Thou shalt come, thou hast clothed, clothing, but thou art ruler. Be, be thou be, so like a, be thou our, our ruler. Thou hast clothing. <laughs> be thou our ruler. You got a nice garment. Be the army. <laughs> Go ahead. And let his and let his ruler be under thy hand. Let, let, let our ruler be under your hand. Yeah. Uh, in, that, in, the, in that day shall he, shall he swear, say, I will be, I will be a healer for in About my heart. He said, in that day shall he be, he swear. Say, I will be an healer. I will, what? I will not be so like I will not be an healer. Mm -hmm. For in my house is neither bread nor clothing. Hey the Lord, hey the Lord is not gonna be a healer, man. Yeah. Make make me a make me not a ruler of thy of the people. For Jerusalem is ruined and Judah is fallen. Because their tongues and their doings are against the Lord. You niggas are ruling, man. Yeah. Ru ruin, man. You niggas are ruling. Hey, you know what? They are in this room. Yeah. Read that part of the book. It's a good part. You say that tongues and their doings are against the Lord. Yeah. Is that, in that day, in that day, in that day, in that day, in that day shall, I, shall he swear, say, I will not be a healer, for in my house is neither bread nor clothing. Make me not a ruler of the people. For Jerusalem is ruined, and Judah is fallen, because their tongue and their doings are against the Lord. They was ready to kill Malcolm X. The dude came to Malcolm X. He said, "He said, uh, what's with you?" He said, "You should have your, you should have your tongue chopped out and had it and hand it to Elijah Muhammad." <laughs> you niggas need your tongues chopped out, man. Go ahead. Like uh, Booker Titus say, there be some of the circumcision yeah. speaking things that they ought not to speak, man. For filthy lucre's sake, man. Yeah, for filthy lucre's sake, them niggas, man. Need your right. tongues chopped out, man. Right. Uh, the shrew of their countenance doeth witness against them, and they declare the, their sins as Sodom and hide had and hide it not. Man, Boy, you could throw General your hand in there. They, yeah. they, they accept the faggots into the yeah. They say you can do it, but, right. Yeah, man. General, you your hand in, you might be a fucking faggot, man. You might be a goddamn faggot, man. to their soul, and they have rewarded evil unto themselves. Yeah, man, you reward you reward unto yourself, man. You think, man, hey, you know, the scriptures say, supposing they gain this godliness from such turn away, man. That's right. You think right. all that fucking purple garments and, and like that nice-ass house you got is, is, is a part of your, 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 your uh, blessing from the Lord, man. You think the Lord is, oh, the Lord is blessing me. I got a camp in Jamaica. 
that's you late as hell, man. Yeah, you late. We didn't have to go to Jamaica for brothers to wake up, man. I mean, so like it, not we, but the elders, the elder apostles didn't have to go to Jamaica for brothers to wake up, man. Brothers just got it, man. Been out there, you late. You, you a fucking, you a fucking Jehovah's Witness, man. Johnny come late. Right. Yeah, man. Yeah, you Jehovah's Witness. Yeah, you Jehovah's Witness, man. No, they're not no Jehovah's Witnesses. Because even Jehovah's Witnesses got faith in their own bullshit. Yeah. 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 Go ahead. Alright. Yeah, yeah. I say, um, uh, I have, have, he said, woe unto their soul, for they have rewarded evil unto themselves. Say ye, yeah, say ye to the righteous, that it shall be well with him, for they shall eat the fruit of their doings. Uh, woe, right, for the fruits of their doings. Woe, woe unto the wicked. It shall be ill with him. For the, for the reward of his hands shall be given him. Okay. Alright, and as as for my people, children are their oppressors. Yeah, the so-called white man, the devil. And That's women it. rule over them. And women rule over them. Your wife fucking runs you, mate. Man. Right. You can tell, man. Only a woman to think of some shit like that. Everybody should work perfect. Only a woman to think of some fucking bullshit like that, man. You should wear, you should be in uniform. Women think of shit like that, man. We don't, men don't coordinate shit like that. We gonna dress it like tomorrow. Men don't do that shit, man. Niggas got lineups and shit, man. Yeah, lineups, niggas got dreads. Dreads. Y'all doing what the fuck y'all wanna do, man. Yeah, they exactly what they want. What the fuck they wanna do, man. Who the fuck do you think the Lord is, man? Oh, man. That's man, that's why, man. Niggas got the dreads and braids and shit, man. Yeah, like, man. Come on, man. That's why, man, we can't wait to destroy the Lord destroy wicked niggas like y'all, man. Niggas worldly, man. That's right. Yeah, niggas, man. Yeah, worldly ass congregation, yeah. man. This is kind of good. Starting to make me hate the color purple. Yeah, man. I gotta go back to uh, finish off with Isaiah. Uh, Isaiah 5 and 23 say, Which justify the wicked for reward and take away the righteousness of the righteous from him. You know? Because just like they, they, they justify the wicked for reward, they're, they're excuse for the. Uh, 501c3 is what uh, they say is uh, is, 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 pro is progress. You know, selling out to the white white man is progress to them. You know, that's justifying your wickedness for reward. You know, because you niggas, you niggas ain't in the spirit of y'all by shooting y'all shot, man. Y'all in the spirit of Satan, man. Doing whatever it takes, bending over, touching your toes for money, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? You might not physically be getting a, a rod in your booty, but spiritually, you're getting a rod in your booty from the right. white man. You know, you perverting people, you perverting the gospel, man, for what? For money. Yeah, man. Nigga, nigga, nigga camp make You know what I'm saying? Niggas, man. They got boot camp and shit, man, you know. Who's this player, man? That, that's sad, man. You, you, have, you have men lined up like this. But then if a brother don't find a scripture within seven seconds, you got to go to the back of the line because you really is, is a failure in IUIC. What kind of shit is that, man? You tearing brothers down. Right. Or well, if they don't get a scripture right, you got to do 50 fucking push-ups, oh, man. Then, then all that shit they do is for fucking show, man. Like that shit in Ferguson, I seen a video on Facebook, man. Them niggas marching through the streets. Yeah. Marching and shit. What the fuck, man? Like that Miller, man, get the fuck out of here, man. You niggas are jokes, man. Hey, but hey, but you do a blood they, they sacrifice. Should've, they should have opened fire on you niggas, man. Right. Hey, another thing, what the brother said is fucked up, man. If uh, you, you're doing that shit, man, making people go to the back. Man. The scriptures say, grieve not thy brother with thy meat, man. Oh, they got a video of them doing that. They got a video of that, man. Some niggas, man. What about Romans 14, man? Some, some, some brothers, Hey, hey, some brothers uh, progress every day alike, man. Right. You know, because you know, some brothers, it's hard for them to come up on some, some type of level, man. Not everybody gonna be on the same level, man. You're gonna be a tyrant. 
I got something real quick. Like your brother, like brother said earlier, man, you got, you got these niggas don't, you niggas don't worship. Nate ain't following the house shot. Yo, and you niggas is following Nate, man. You a fucking abomination for following. It's uh Jeremiah 17 and 5. Thus says the Lord, curse be the man that trusted in man, and maketh his flesh his arm, and whose heart departed from the Lord. 